Okay, so back on and back at it. I'm really sorry. I got a phone call and now people are on the way here and things like that. It's kind of difficult to do these YouTubes or whatever. So, you know, time is valuable. It is what it is. And, you know, I appreciate all you guys who like the channel, follow the channel, watch my videos, etc. But people in person, in real life, in front of my eyes, in front of my face, and whatever, they take priority over doing talking to my camera in the back closet place or whatever, right? So, anyway, getting back to this comment again, same video. I like to be in depth and try to respond to people to the best of my abilities. So, continuing the comment where it left off about something brian phillips MGTOWers five levels okay we working we have indifferent i'm reading the quote here by the way we have indifferent and understand female hypergamy we also work on improving ourselves and finding our purpose most of us are not monk mode but protect our resources and sanity in a mouse utopia um I think you are short-sighted on MGTOW men. There are content providers such as Hammerhand, RPM, RPOS, and Howard Deer that you can add more depth to your understanding. I still date, but choose to remain separate, and they have a full understanding of the MGTOW philosophy. Whatever, man. It's whatever works for you, I guess. By the way, I, I'm familiar with some of those people's chair, uh, channels and shows or whatever. It is what it is. But actually, I'm at the phase of my life right now where I don't listen to any of their content actually not just them but i'm through i'm through with this whole ideal ideology battle about that shit or whatever the thing is obviously again look at my wall look at my pictures uh i want girls to be in my life at this point in my life and i'm happy with things the way they are so if you're happy with the way things are for you whatever maybe you want pictures of motorcycles on your wall or whatever the fuck you do i don't know but whatever makes you happy do what you're going to do, man. Okay? You don't have to justify your decisions or things to me. Likewise, I don't have to justify anything that I do to you guys. I don't know you motherfuckers or whatever. So this is just an interesting way. YouTube, My YouTube channel and the reason I do these videos are actually for me to spit back feedback about what I think about various people's philosophies, thoughts, and whatever you know because obviously my mind does not work the same way as a lot of people's brains i'm my brain's different i'm a different person than you i you shouldn't expect me to act or think like you or me you know because you don't have the same lines of code as me etc cetera, etc cetera. so your mileage may vary yeah but anyway do whatever makes you fucking happy man shit you know you don't have to explain that to me in a long paragraph i think i did i write a reply there i did even what did i reply back i wrote uh, come on, slow internet here. <laughs> loading. For whatever reason, that's still loading. Okay, next person. Curtis Ch Chiloquin. If I'm saying that correctly. Um, for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. Well, with the long hair and teeth cleaning, he can blend in with the Wamin. Cleaning, shaved guy, so you blend in with them? Uh... Females in modern time make you broke your back and your bank. You are not in the West, but whatever works for you. Not all are monk. Keep an eye on your assets. Females will manipulate it out of you if you do not think it through. Okay. Well, I don't know where to begin here. Um, I do have long hair and I do get my teeth cleaned. I think it's a positive thing to have hair and teeth in this world or whatever, you know. If you have teeth, you should take care of them. Teeth are kind of important. Hair is kind of important, too, to me. I don't really fuck with barbershops and shit. I like to, for the most part, grow my hair. Yeah. What is this clean, shaved guy? I guess I'd like to have a clean, shaved face. That's correct. I don't really like facial hair, mustaches, beards, sideburns. I like to feel clean, that's right. Clean shaved guy, so I blend in with them. You're saying that I blend in with women. <laughs> Hold on a minute, where's my song at? I blend in with women. 
Sorry, my thumbs are slow. Oh, I can't play my song. YouTube's putting an ad on before the song. They're doing two ads. Y'all getting cheap. Like a what? Like a pimp. <laughs> More like an e-pimp. I like that song anyway. So what's the next comment on here? I'm just fucking around here. Anyway, the guy's point is, yeah, I got long hair, teeth, clean teeth, and I'm shaved. Females in modern time make you broke. Well, I mean, if you, if you let girls break you, they gonna break you. What you break off to them should be up to you. The question is, are you hurting yourself? If so, stop hurting yourself. Self-harm isn't good. But you got to trade something for something. Quid pro quo. You know? You don't have to trade your money. Maybe you can trade your time. Maybe you can just, like, listen or something. See how far that gets you. But money's a motherfucker, though, too. You know, whatever floats your boat or gets the, gets the mission done. Females, you are not in the West. Actually, I am in the West. I'm in Canada right now. And uh, I know the previous video the guy's talking about, I was doing it from a condo in Thailand. But um, yeah, I'm from the West. I'm from California. I'm American, Canadian. I'm lots of shit, nigga. Just, I'm, I can be in the West or the East. I, I, I use the white man's airplanes and air, airlines. They like go like 500 miles an hour anywhere in the world if you just pay them enough money. It's true. I've done it, see? Next comment. Snap off monkey branch nine months ago. I figured you for 20-something. The world is changing and you are behind the curve. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah. No, I'm not 20-something. I'm actually 41, almost 42 years old. You know, the pussy juice keeps me young. I don't know, but I'm a runner. I exercise, I work out, I eat healthy, I do intermittent fasting, I take vitamins, I do lots of shit to stay young and healthy and active or whatever. You know what I'm saying? Some people, what really trips me out about a lot of people is they invest in a lot of things before they invest in themselves. You know what I'm saying? They, they'll invest in the stock market and this and they'll buy all sorts of shit before they invest in their self, in their own fucking bodies. Like, it doesn't make any sense to me. Before I buy any clothes, this and that, I get my first shit internally done well. Excellent quality nutrition, supplements, vitamins, exercise routine, sleep routine, eating routine. Like, treat your body like a machine and it'll perform well, you know? And just do general basic maintenance. Like, some people don't maintain their cars. You know, if you look at your service manual in your car, you probably got like a... 50,000 mile service, uh, 80,000 mile service, etc. Um, certain like Mercedes Benz will have like an A service and a B service. Special lights will come on and it's just got to be maintained and tightened, right? Your body's the same way. So as you age, you have to uh, basically take enough vitamins and shit so that your body and bones absorb the shit that it's lost is all that I'm getting at. Yeah, but yeah, I'm 42. All right. Um, next comment. Douglas R. One year ago. You're fine. Just don't marry and don't cohabitate. No civil contracts and no commitments and no children. Damn, nigga. <laughs> I've been married before I got kids. It's it's not that bad. Uh, these motherfuckers, it's not that bad, dog, really. Your parents did it. Derek Lopez, MGTOW for life. Yeah. All right, whatever you want, dude. Um, Leaf Church, 
two months ago. There's a whole range covered within this philosophy from PUAs to monks. We're not a homogeneous, homogeneous bunch. For me, it's more dangerous to my mental health when there's a woman in my life. I've already been a husband and a father. Failed at both. <laughs> I don't blame women. I'm sorry for laughing, man. I'm, I blame the unrealistic expectations we are taught in modern society. Damn, dog. I'm actually going to give you a thumbs up on your comment. Leaf Church. Okay, but let's go over what you're saying here. P uh, from whole range covered within this philosophy. From PUAs to monks. PUA, for you guys who don't know, stands for Pick Up Artist. It's a subset of guys that study how to pick up chicks and shit doesn't really work or whatever but anyway and monks are i guess you would call them the opposite spectrum where they don't have women in their life at all so these are he's saying this his philosophy covers a range of things like a windshield wiper i don't really have a philosophy myself so whatever we're not a homogeneous bunch we're not all the same basically for me it's more dangerous to my mental health when there's a woman in your life man damn the last chick really fucked with your head, but you still got to really get over that, man. I can say it to you like this, man. Like, uh, one girl is not worth a thousand. How about that? If you have the choice of a thousand versus one, choose the thousand at the end of the day. But, again, I don't know what your needs, wants, or requirements are in life. But, um, sounds like you got your feelings hurt or whatever and you don't want to go through that shit again. Understandable. You know, so you know what's the best for your mental health.